Hey everyone, spring has officially sprung here and uh, with it uh, all the bugs and uh, what have you that uh, come with it. I've got a giant box elder tree here from my neighbor's house and uh, as such uh, I get a lot of great visitors like this, uh, this little fellow right up here. Uh, I get infested every year by these little box elder bugs. Yeah, more over here on the side. There's a whole bunch up there. They always congregate on the the sunny the the sunny side of the the house here. For a long time I was battling them coming inside. They somehow managed to find uh, the little cracks and crevices and uh, and come into my house. In addition to that, uh, spiders uh, we get in, you know, I've got uh, the concrete here and then, you know, where the siding meets the concrete there, you know, potential entry points for spiders and other critters. Anyway, today I want to show you how I have uh, resolved that. This is my fifth year uh, doing the same treatment and I haven't had to buy any new treatment or new chemical for the last five years. The stuff I'm going to show you lasts forever and it completely eradicates these box elder bugs and spiders. I only have to do two applications uh, each year and, uh, and that keeps them at bay. So with that uh, introduction, let me uh, show you uh, the stuff I use and how to apply it. Okay, this is the magic stuff. It's by Syngenta Demand CS. This is the magic potion that uh, rids you of uh, bugs with only two applications every year. Uh, this is the eighth uh, ounce uh, bottle that I've got here. I don't know if you can see, uh, but uh, I've still got uh, a little bit left. Only uses a few ounces uh, for gallons of water. I just use a pump style sprayer and uh, usually apply two gallons worth of product uh, each time I spray. And uh, you can see here, if I get the little book lit open here, um, we've got everything under the sun. We've got ants, box elder bugs, bees, um, cockroaches, fleas, flies, uh, I mean, mosquitoes, sow bugs, spiders, termites, ticks, wasps, uh, crickets. I mean, there's so many different uh, things that uh, this takes care of and it's super easy uh, you just um, comes with this little thing right here to measure the product out dump it in the sprayer mix it up with some water so let's do that and uh, we'll apply it so to mix this up it's really quite easy just take the cap off the small side there squeeze the bottle and it has this little built-in measuring uh, cup for you dump it into your sprayer Try to get as much of it out as you possibly can, and then fill your sprayer up with water uh, for however many gallons you're going to mix up. In my case, I was mixing up a uh, quantity of about two gallons uh, of this stuff to spray around my whole house. Um, I have a pump style tank sprayer, so just pump the thing up with the pressure and then uh, proceed to spray. I spray across all the door thresholds and uh, any cracks like that that uh, may allow bugs entry into my house. And uh, as you can see, it's really easy just across the bottom. Any penetrations like that outlet, uh, I spray around those. And then right here where the siding comes down and meets the concrete foundation, I always spray a continuous line across there because that tends to be where the spiders and other bugs uh, get in uh, most commonly. The box elder bugs um, are more common through penetrations like this right here. Uh, they tend to come in through those and then they also come in around my windows. Um, so I spray around my windows uh, just a, a line around them is all you need. And, uh, and then I also spray around my garage doors because they have a tendency to come through those. They're not 100% sealed. So anyway, it's pretty easy and pretty painless. So uh, I'll put a picture up uh, right here of the product. It uh, is available on Amazon. I'll leave a link uh, down below. Uh, you may 
think as did I right at first. Gosh, that's expensive for such a tiny bottle. But as you saw, it uh, is just a tiny amount uh, for multiple gallons of water. So a little goes a long way. And uh, it's the real stuff. Uh, this is what the professionals use. And, uh, and it's awesome. And uh, pro tip uh, for the end here, don't forget to rinse your sprayer out really well uh, so that it's uh, ready to be used the next time. If you like this kind of video, please uh, be sure and uh, leave a like and subscribe and we'll catch you on the next one.